Hi, and welcome to Green by Design TV. I'm Connie. And I'm Greg. We'll be your host for the next half hour as we look at what folks around the tri-state area are doing to lead a more considered, healthier life. One thing that we would like to get across with this show is don't let the fact that you can't swing your ideal solution stop you from taking some sort of action to live healthy. You know, you don't need a whole lot of money to take some steps toward leading a greener lifestyle. Not only are the resources available, but the incentives from the state and the federal government are incredible. That's now right. is the time. It takes one third a pound of pesticides to make one t-shirt. It reduces the consumption of water that we use here from 50 or 60 gallons a car to about 13 to 15 gallons a car, which is a pretty big deal. A traditional well built house may have an air change of say five air changes or air volumes of the house each hour. This house only has 0.5, so 0 0.5 air changes. During the day, the wall will absorb thermal energy. And at night, it will slowly release that energy back into the house. Which warms up the vegetable oil to a thin enough consistency that it can be used as fuel. And then I pretty much just hit a switch and my car is running on straight vegetable oil. Obviously, some pretty sophisticated computers need to be on board in order to control all of the dynamic switching. CSA stands for Community Supported Agriculture. The fundamental premise is that the farmer, the person who actually grows the food, has a direct relationship with the people who eat the food. Until the next time, keep thinking green. It's good for the earth. And it's good for you. What? Hey! What? Oh, I'm, I'm wearing green! green. Oh, oh, oh. Green!